Patkova? Okay. So this is a normal saline bottle and this is the infusion control set. This is the control throttle, this is the infusion control valve and this is the needle which goes right into the patient. Okay. Now we are introducing a saline infusion alarm. The alarm is attached here. This is the alarm. It's a very low cost alarm which we have designed. This is the normal function of the alarm. Okay? This alarm is attached with a spring-loaded switch. Now as miniature load cells are not available here and even if it is available, that is very costly. So we have converted this spring balance to a spring-activated switch. Now we hang this bottle here on the switch. This is half filled. We have calibrated roughly in and around 90 to 110 milliliter of saline will be there and the alarm will start functioning. Okay, now we will open this control. Right. There you see fluid coming out from the needle. Now let's see the triggering point. has started triggering and the fluid is roughly 70-80 milliliter or something like that. Ah yes, less than 100 milliliter. Now this triggering will go on, the alarm will go on unless and until somebody attends 